As kids and parents prepare for the new school year, so are teachers, administrators, and other officials. And tonight's CAX conversation and training is taking place soon to help athletic and recreational sports programs be better prepared for emergencies. Robin Gust joins us now. She's a certified athletic trainer. Robin, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for allowing me to be here. It's my pleasure. Awesome. So tell us when and where is the training event taking place? The training event is going to be at Ward County um, Emergency Services and Administration Building in Minot, and it's going to be August 1st from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. And what exactly will this training cover, Robin? We are really excited to offer this training because it is free and it is a sports medicine clinic and emergency preparedness clinic. And we're going to include a variety of topics that are going to be so valuable for coaches, for administrators. And I think where we're really wanting to get some people in is there's such a large number of recreational sport coaches, too, for youth soccer, youth baseball, AAU basketball, all those different types of things. Anybody that's involved in um, sports in any capacity. We want to help you be more prepared for your sport as well as what happened, what to do if something bad really, or something bad happens. Now, can just anyone attend this event? Absolutely. It's not limited to, you don't have, a, have to have a particular credential. Even if you're a parent and you want to know more about these types of things, you're more than welcome to come. We just ask that you register because seating is limited. We want to make sure that we have enough tables and chairs for everybody as well as handouts. So um, anyone is more than welcome to come and, and we are really excited about this event. Now, Robin, how do people register? If you were to go to the Ward County Emergency Management site, there is a link on on the post about the event, or you can contact me as well, and I can help you get to that link. Some great information there, Robin. Is there anything else you'd like to add? Well, I think that, you know, there's been a couple of things that happened in the last year that really kind of showed us that being prepared for for athletics or a sporting event is so valuable and as a huge buffalo bills fan i think um you know what happened to demar really brought that to the light that had they not had the preparedness on the sideline they had he that young man would not be here today and we can say that actually about uh, a, a local a local game here that a young man the same thing happened and the right people were in the right place but they also had the right knowledge and tools to save that young man's life and that's why this is so very valuable for anybody that's going to work with youth or athletics two great examples there rob and we appreciate you coming on and speaking with us about this thank you so much and again thank you for having me thanks